Welcome to the training session on the latest features of TEIA Portal Test Suite Advanced Version 19. Starting from TEIA Portal Test Suite Version 16, you have the ability to create application tests for automated testing of your PLC program using PLC SIM Advanced. With TEIA Portal Version 19, a new mode has been introduced which allows you to execute the test case on a pre-configured PLC SIM Advanced instance. Enabling this mode eliminates the need for compiling and downloading the test case into a newly created S7 PLC SIM Advanced instance, saving you time when executing test cases repeatedly or in large quantities. In the new init section, you can configure a memory reset before starting the test case execution, giving you the flexibility to create both dependent and independent test cases. Now let's explore how you can utilize and benefit from this feature in TIA Portal. In the provided sample project, a simple Pythagoras function is implemented and called in the main program. The project also includes an application test with multiple test steps to validate the Pythagoras function under different scenarios. Each test step involves setting the input values, evaluating the actual output values after a PLC cycle, and comparing them with the expected values. To run the test case on an existing PLC SIM advanced instance, you need to switch the mode in the editor toolbar. The selected mode will be saved in the project or in the exported test case file. Please ensure that the PLC SIM advanced instance is created, and your PLC program is downloaded to it prior to running the test case. Specify the name of this instance in the scope selector of the test case. You are now ready to execute the test. Check the test result to for past and failed test steps. You may have noticed that TIA Portal version 19 allows to specify additional user comments in the assert statement. You can query the state of any other signal using AND as a notation. In case of errors, you can jump to the specific line in the test case and adapt the test case if required. Now simply executed the test case again. Using the new execution mode reduces the test execution time significantly. By the way, the modified application test has a blue flag, which means it is marked for check-in. In TIA Portal version 19, application tests, style guide rule sets and system tests can be edited in a multi-user session and checked in via multi-user mechanisms into a server project. Beside performance improvement, the new execution mode gives the possibility to go online and record a trace while running application test. The trace has been configured to record input and outputs of the Pythagoras function. Every test steps runs one cycle so that 8 PLC cycles as record duration are sufficient in this example. The trace is started if the trigger variable is set to true. Enable save measurement on device if you want to save a specific number of measurements on the memory card. In the application test you two additional steps have been added to set and reset the trigger variable of the trace. Please make sure to download the trace and activate the recording before running the application test. By doing so, a trace will automatically be recorded on every test run. This feature can be particularly useful for debugging or documenting the functionality you are testing. Finally, let's take a look at the other improvements in the TI Portal Test Suite V19. We've already discussed the benefits of multi-user support and user comments in assert statements. With the S7 PLC SIM Advanced version 6, you can simulate S7 1500 software and open controller. This, combined with the new execution mode, enables you to run applications on these types of controllers. Additionally, these test and test involving fail-safe PLCs can now be automated by using the openness function download PLC to somatic memory card folder. Apart from application tests, 
The TIA Portal Test Suite also provides system test capabilities. By utilizing OPC UA, you can connect to real hardware controllers and perform comprehensive system tests. And now with version 19, the system test supports all the three types of OPC UA server interfaces, Somatic Server Interface, User-Defined Interface and Companion Specification created with Xiaomi. This gives you the flexibility to choose the interface that best suits your needs. Moreover, system tests can be saved in the master copies and can now be fully managed through openness as well. Thank you for your attention and enjoy TIA Portal version 19.